Good morning. I'm currently at Hobby Lobby. So I think today's vlog is going to be like a shop with me. And I've got my list of stuff here. I'm trying to shop for my living room and my bedroom. And I'm wanting to redo the lamps in my bedroom. So I'm currently in the lamp section trying to figure out if there's anything here today. They are 50% off, so that's good. Trying to find something that obviously goes with my foresty theme. This one's kind of cool, but not quite right. This one is interesting. This one's really interesting. There's only one of them, and I don't, I don't love it, so I don't. Don't see anything here today. Amazing. I'm currently trying to shop for my fireplace. Sorry for the overhead talking. She's gonna she's gonna go for a minute. All right, so I'm currently focused on trying to shop for the living room. I want to do something very along the lines of like my new decorating aesthetic. So I've got a bunch of candle holders which are on sale. These are not on sale, but I can't wait till next week because this video is going to go up this week. So I'm just going to use a 40% off on this and I think it's going to look really pretty. This is one of my favorite aisles by the way. This is one, the one I got for my pie safe. So, so pretty you guys. But I'm telling you, this is absolutely my favorite aisle in Hobby Lobby. Look how gorgeous all this stuff is. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this. Oh my. Like, I can't even fit it all into one frame. That is stunning. It's $100. But 50% off, it would be $50. Oh my god. Look at this purple. Oh my god, this purple one is absolutely stunning. I'm purple, I'm not really drawn to, but this, for some reason, I'm into. And I think for springtime, I am I might do a purple moment. What do you guys think? All right, so now I need to find some fall floral to go in those vases by my TV. And I obviously want something along like this neutral palette. I just don't like these little berry things.
Okay, so I'm... All right, so what I'm doing now is trying to figure out what I'm gonna do about those two, um, like, floral items that I have on my TV stand in the living room. And I think I'm gonna get these gorgeous sunflowers that are green. Oh my God, they're stunning. Let me show you what else I got. So I have, I'm gonna get six. I don't know if I'm gonna need more or not, but I also got these like tall white pumpkin picks and I'm just gonna kind of like arrange it together in that vase that I already have. I'm gonna take out the tulips and then try to arrange this in there and hopefully it's going to look good. So have that figured out. But I think I also want some garland to sit on top of the TV stand as well. But nothing is kind of calling out to me. This is really beautiful, but I'm not doing orange. I mean, I guess I could. I need some color. And I'm not into metallics, so I'm not gonna do that. You guys love Christmas stuff. Oh my gosh. I love Christmas stuff so much. I love the sparkly lights. I mean, who doesn't love sparkly lights? Gingerbread stuff is coming out, which I'm so excited because I'm going to do my kitchen the same this year. And I'm already thinking these two. Oh my gosh. This gingerbread house is everything. All right, so I finished shopping at Hobby Lobby and I decided that I wanted to go ahead and quickly throw in the haul into this vlog. I normally do like my home decor hauls and all of that, as most of you do know, because I think a lot of you came over from my main channel, but if you're new to my vlogs and you don't know about my main channel, all of that like vlogging for home decor and decorating goes up on that channel, which is always linked down below. I, as some of you guys saw in the clip, I got these little pumpkins on a stem. They had the natural look. They also came in orange. They came in even like a more natural, like a wicker style. Then I got this garland. It's absolutely beautiful. It's really hard to obviously can't get the whole thing on the camera but here's what it looks like up close love the orange colors in here i got this for my living room but i don't actually know quite yet if i'm bringing in orange i think i'm bringing i might be bringing in yellow instead so if i don't use this in my living room then i'm gonna maybe use it in my bedroom because i'm also gonna decorate for my bedroom that's also gonna be on my main channel uh, but I didn't have plans to use this kind of garland in my bedroom. So this could actually end up being a return. Then I got this beautiful garland. Floral was not on sale, but I'm, I'm putting up my video for my living room this week. And I couldn't wait till next week for the sale. So I just used a 40% off coupon. It's just a regular green vine. So, so pretty. Love it. Um, that's going to be for the fireplace. All right, this next item is not fall related. It's for my kitchen. And I waited, it's been about a month that I finally got my hands on these because when I decided to get them, they were out of stock. And then the sale hasn't been, like it's been like flip-flopping. These are the wooden like pedestals. They were $39.99 each, so but 50% off today and they were $20. I'm thinking I'm gonna use this for my kitchen sink area if it works out the way that I am envisioning it. Um, so if it doesn't, they'll also be a return. So it just kind of depends. I got two of them because I want to put my lamps on top of it and then maybe do like a little like wreath or greenery like thing around it. I don't know. Okay, then let's talk pumpkins here. I got this pumpkin and then a smaller version, which I already have two of these, but I use them for my bedroom. They were in my fall bedroom decor decorate with me for 2019. So if you haven't seen that style, um, 
it's in my fall playlist on my main channel. I really love the natural element. I think these would look really cute in my living room. That's kind of what I'm going for. So, and it just dawned on me just now that I planned for everything in my living room for fall except for that, that console table that I have up against the wall. All right. I'm sure I'll figure something out. Anyways, I really debated back and forth a while in Hobby Lobby because I wasn't sure, do I want color in the living room or do I want like natural colored pumpkins, white, greens to mix with my everyday decor? So I don't know that I'm gonna bring in orange, but that's just for the living room. Uh, my entryway does have orange in it and I actually needed more of these like wicker-like pumpkins. Yeah, sure. And yeah, they're gonna go on my wreath. So I'll probably do like a clip after this to show you guys what it what the section looks like. And then I found these gorgeous little pumpkins. They're definitely brand new. They were not at Hobby Lobby last year. They're $4.99 each, but they were 40% off. I am in love. I think the green is so pretty. And just look at this, like, not that cute? I just love it. I love these little green pumpkins. They also had these in navy, by the way, and like a brownish nude color. So love that. And then I think you guys saw in the clip that I got these amazing uh, sunflower picks in green. Oh my gosh. Literally, literally Hobby Lobby is like a dream come true. It's like my candy store. I went into the floral section of the fall floral section of Hobby Lobby and I just could not find like a bunch of flowers that could go into my living room and I was just like oh I don't know what I'm gonna do so then I ventured back into the fall section which for some reason is two different sections at Hobby Lobby that's the one thing I wish they didn't do I wish everything for Christmas was all together and everything for falls all together but it's not that way in my stores they'll have like weird random little like center things throughout like I don't know anyone else's store like that irrelevant but these are just stunning you guys stunning and I love the green color in this it's not overly green so it kind of has that muted style for fall and I, I really like it so hopefully they'll look good if not I, I don't know okay the next things and honestly these could be a return because let me kind of walk you guys through I'm gonna do a whole pumpkin fiasco on my fireplace and I was just like you know a bunch of pumpkins that's gonna be kind of costly uh, so I may return these and just go to Dollar Tree and get small pumpkins which we know that they have and just DIY them myself myself and then paint them white so these actually have words on it but it's gonna be on my fireplace so I I turned them around and thought, oh, they look really good like this, you know, cute. But this is kind of what I was going for. And I thought I could definitely DIY this. So I'm gonna check, I'm gonna go through my stash, see what extra pumpkins I have uh, that I could paint. And if I decide to do that, these are all gonna be a return because they were $4.99, but they were 40% off. So they were about like, what, a three, three-ish bucks in that ballpark so I got a bunch of these um, little pumpkins for the fireplace a bunch of them I don't, I don't know how many how many I grabbed all right I did get Christmas stuff I did it happened I love planning ahead I like I, I, I live for this stuff okay so I am still gonna do a gingerbread theme I started a gingerbread theme was it last year in my kitchen obsessed so I found some new gingerbread houses once upon a time let me tell you Hobby Lobby had a full aisle of gingerbread stuff then it just wasn't trendy so they only have like one of those little aisle cap display things and I thought let me grab these while they're here okay I mean I'm sure they're gonna keep stocking but here's the next one super cute they were $14.99 but Christmas is marked at 40% off now. Anyways, then I got a bunch of the candlesticks. So kind of, this is what I'm, this is kind of what I'm going for. And I wanted a bunch. 
And luckily, Hobby Lobby happened to have, Loxie's leaning up again, sorry. Hobby Lobby happened to have a bunch of these in stock. So I got two of these of the same height. And then there's one, there was only one of the like middle, middle height. And then I got two of the tallest ones. So there's that. So I got a total of five candle holders, but I, I think that'll be good. I'm, I might expand next year because I really want it to be like a bunch of candle holders and pumpkins and, um, but maybe five's going to be just fine. So anyways, I believe that's it for the haul and, um, I'm very excited. I feel like the house is finally getting into a groove, um, of me moving through it and getting it decorated. So the living room's going to be next, then my bedroom. Um, I actually don't have any huge plans for my kitchen because I'm still decorating my kitchen from an everyday living perspective. So I don't know what's going to go down in that area, but I do want to decorate the media room. So that's coming because we're going to change out the posters, the movie posters, and I want to decorate the guest bedroom as well, or the guest bathroom upstairs as well. So all of that is to come and I'm still working on the, the library in here. I'm still searching for furniture. I just can't make a decision. Um, Amazon actually had these two green chairs. I thought I could do like one big oversized chair for myself with like a um, ottoman. I could sit there and lounge and read. That's the point. I want to be cozy. But then I wanted it to kind of have a conversational sense as well. And I found these two green chairs and I didn't act on it from Amazon. And now, so I'm mad. I'm mad at myself for not going for those damn chairs. So I'm going to keep watching. Hopefully they'll come back in stock. And, um, so hopefully this room is going to get done before Christmas so that, you know, we can add twinkle lights to all this and, and all of that. Anyways, that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time.